We have a new tool that I want to show you. It's in our apps page and it's you come over here under text alerts and there's a tool you can put in here to get in a daily uh, returning visitor report. So if you put in your email, like let's just say you're a client at realtycandy.com, client at realtycandy.com, save that and then click this to on, then that will activate the, um, the email updates. So what it is is these are IDX broker clients who have signed up and you'll get a daily update when they come back and visit your site so you can know who's there. You're going to need to copy this script that's specific for your account and this little part of the page, let me see if I can scroll up here, down here you click on the about and it says uh, you need to be logged in where you can go to the subheaders and then you just click a button to turn the WYSIWYG off, then copy that code, this code right here, copy, paste it in the page right here on the subheaders page. And after this has been saved, you can go back to IDX add-ons and verify that it's working using the validate button. So let me show you real quickly how that works. So if we come here to this account, if you'll come here to the subheaders page, and what I would recommend is you just hit this HTML button. You can also turn the WYSIWYG off, which is what the instruction says. So that's probably the best way. You set that there, push save changes. Then we'll come back over here. Let's validate it. This takes about 60 seconds um, for our server to go check the web pages and make sure it's in place. And you can see that it's showing on this page, but not this one. So somehow it's not showing on the results page, and it's not showing on the featured property pages, and it's not showing on the search page. So I'm assuming that that means that they have some other subheaders in there on those pages. Let's just take a quick look. Sure enough, they've got uh, different subheaders on those categories. So in this case, we would need to go into each of those and add the code to the subheader and, and such. So we'd have to come in here and uh, let's see what they got here. Okay, well they've just got have that little code snippet so now we'll, we'll save that. Come over here to map search. Again, we're gonna turn, uh, slide down here, turn WYSIWYG off. Again, they have that little code snippet here. Let's save that. And then we'll come over here to the results page, turn WYSIWYG off. We'll stick that in there. Okay, let's come back and validate again. We'll just see if these uh, code snippets are found there. The server verifies that they're there. Okay, so they're ready to go on all their pages. Now they'll get an email every day showing when these uh, visitors come back to their website. And it's that simple to set up.